What's up guys, iDevice Help here. Today in this video, we're going to be talking about Apple's CarPlay, which was introduced for iOS 8, but the only way you can access iOS hands-free CarPlay is if your vehicle has it built into the head unit. Basically, newer models for 2015 have CarPlay built in, and also you can buy third-party head units, which you can install to your vehicle and use Apple's CarPlay that way as well. Now, I did review a unit by Pioneer in the video description down below. I'll have the video, so you can go ahead and check out that unit. But if you have an iPad mounted onto your vehicle's dashboard, this new application, Ignition, which is now submitted through Cydia for the jailbreak community, brings the Apple CarPlay experience to iOS on the iPad and also the iPhone 6 Plus. It also supports the iPad mini as well. So if you haven't jailbroken your iOS device yet, I'll link you in the description down below to my jailbreak tutorial. You can jailbreak your iOS devices super easy. Then you wanna go ahead and launch Cydia. And here on the search tab, you wanna go ahead and search for the Ignition application and go ahead and install it. Once you install it, you'll get the application which will be sitting here on your springboard. And you wanna go ahead and tap on the application and it will respring your iPad. Now, once it's done, it's going to prompt you with the Apple CarPlay. Then, right after the CarPlay image disappears, you want to tap on the Home button, and you should get the UI pop up right away. There it is. Very simple. Now, everything works exactly the same. Again, this is very useful if you have an iPad mounted onto your vehicle's dash. You can use iOS hands-free. Very easy to do. Now, you do get all the same controls. Everything is exactly the same as you would find it with the Apple CarPlay UI. You get your music. You get your maps. Everything is hands-free. If you get a text, again, if you're using it on the 6 Plus or even iPads, if you get a text, Siri will help you. Who would you like to text? As you can see there, it didn't ask me to type anything. It automatically went hands-free. That is what Apple CarPlay is all about. Now, you also have the Now Playing, which you can control your music and also control your navigation with your maps. Very cool. Very awesome to have this on the iPad. Now, if you go ahead and jump here into the Ignition application one more time, it'll bring you right back to the standard iOS use. So all you have to do is just tap on the application to use Apple CarPlay and then tap on it again just to have your standard use. So there you guys have it. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button. I really do appreciate it when you thumbs up my videos. Make sure you subscribe for lots of cool videos coming your way. I'll also have my social networks in the video description along with the jailbreak tutorial and also my Pioneer CarPlay review as well. Make sure you check those out. It's been iDevice and I will catch you guys really soon. Peace.